Today I'm going to be reading The Three Pigs by David Wisner. The Three Pigs. Once upon a time, there were three pigs who went out into the world to see their fortune. The first pig decided to build a house and he built it out of straw. Along came a wolf who knocked at the door and said, little pig, little pig, let me come in. And the pig answered, not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. The wolf said, then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. So the wolf huffed and he puffed and he blew the house in and ate the pig up. But here's this pig hanging off the page. Hey, he blew me right out of the story. And you can see he's holding on halfway out of the story. Now the second pig built his house out of sticks. Along came the wolf who knocked on the door and said, little pig, little pig, let me come in. And the pig answered, not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. The wolf said, then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. So the wolf huffed and he puffed and he blew the house in and ate the pig up. But there they are. This pig is coming half off the page and this one says, come on, it's safe out here. Out of the page. And now they're coming off the page here. The old traditional book, the third pig built his house out of bricks, but it says, why didn't you, wow, why didn't you two get eaten up? We got away from that wolf for good. And this one says, now we have room to move. Watch this, oops. And he's bouncing off the pages. They are hiding on the pages, walking around. Let's explore this place. Okay, just let me fold this up. Looks like he's folding it like a uh, airplane. Aha, uh -huh. page is flying through the air. The pigs are flying. Whee! And this pig is holding it up. This one's just barely hanging on. I love the use of the white space on here. And there they are, flying. You can just see their bottoms. Uh-oh, I see some trouble approaching. Uh, looks like their airplane skidded through. Oof, hey, over here. Wait, what's that? I think someone's out there. Come help us with this. So they see some cartoon land and the pigs walking into the hay diddle diddle, the cat in the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon. The little dog laughed to see such a sport and the dish ran away with the spoon. And you can see the pigs jumping out of the page there. There's the cat and the fiddle walking out of the page too. And the pig says, let's get out of here. Phew, where to, says this pig. This one, come on. How about in here? Whoops. And another medium here that looks like drawing. And here's the pigs in and out. You can see this pig right here, his foot's in. This one's holding up this, it says, hold still. And this is a story about a dragon. You can see the pig and the dragon. High on a hill, there lived a great dragon who stood guard over a rose made of the purest gold. The king was determined to own this treasure. So he sent his eldest son to slay the dragon and bring back the golden rose. And there they are, the dragon and the pig is coming out. Come with us, hurry. And here they are. 
They're out of the book. And the dragon says, many thanks for rescuing me, O oh brave and noble swine. And the pig says, don't mention it. Look, who's here? Welcome, it's Hey Diddle Diddle. And then you can see the... The fish coming out of the page here. And here is a pig. He says, now what? Find something. What is this? This one says, it's my place. Notice the brickwork? I did it myself. They're looking at the picture of the three little pigs home. A fine castle, methinks. Yes, it's very nice. You know what? Let's go home. Good idea. We just have to pick these up. And you see they're picking up the pages of the book to put it back together. And we're back into the three little pigs. And the pig answered, not by the hair on my chinny chin chin. And the wolf says, then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. Ah! And you can see there's the dragon blowing down the, the wolf and all of the creatures are here. It starts to say the wolf huffed and he, and all the letters are jumbled up. And here this pig is like, Okay, that's enough. So we see that the pigs are trying to put the pages back together. Come inside, everyone. Soup's on. I think we're going to like it here, says the cat. And they lived happily ever after. The end.